What is up guys? Welcome to one of how to smartphones videos. In this video, we'll be taking a look at the Galaxy S25 Ultra. We'll be starting it up, um, powering it up, to getting it to the home screen, just going through all the steps. Uh, we'll just do a quick look. Um, so here it is, sweet new phone. Go ahead, pop it out of the box here. And first things first, first time it's been powered on, I'm gonna go ahead, press and hold that power button. It's right here on the side, there's volume up, down button. We're pressing and holding that power button on this side. I'm gonna press and hold. And takes a little bit, and just like that, it went ahead and powered up, showing us a Samsung Galaxy screen um, secured by Knox. Nice, thick. This is the um, Galaxy S25 Ultra. We can go ahead and do the startup, pass through that um, screen, startup wizard. So here we are, we're looking to start. Going to select start. There's an English, you can change the language. Um, just went with English. Um, terms and conditions and the policy and then setting diagnostics i usually don't so we'll just go ahead and hit agree there um and it says here you can um and uh, easy setup with another device i'm just going to be doing we'll set up later so we'll go ahead and you're going to choose a wi-fi um and here's what i have at my place go ahead and type in the password just like that got my password in there gonna go ahead and sign up once it's connecting, now it's going to be um, preparing for mobile connection. We're going to go ahead and set this up later in settings. It says getting your phone ready. This may take a few minutes. Some device information that's needed for setup will be sent to Google, your carrier, and their partners. And I'm not looking to activate this phone. I'm just trying to get it through the steps to get it to the home screen. And here it says, copy apps and data. You can choose to transfer your apps, photos, contacts, Google account, and more. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and hit don't copy. I don't want none of my stuff transferred over for many of my devices. Just trying to get to the home screen so I can check out the device, um, take a look at it. So let's keep on jumping through these steps. Uh, it's going to ask for Google sign-in. I'm going to skip and skip that. Um, it's asking for a security on your phone. Uh, I'll be making a video on that, protect your phone, so I'm going to be skipping that. It says, are you sure you want to skip? I'm going to skip anyway. Here, Google Services, scroll down, and you have to accept in order to move on. It says, getting your phone ready. This may take a few moments. Um, we'll go down here, and we'll do setup later in settings. And then here it says, do you want a Samsung account? No, let's go ahead and hit skip there as well. And it's um, saying Samsung service legal information, terms and condition, that and that. And then it gives you a couple other options. We'll go ahead and hit more. And then do you want all that? Just we'll hit agree. Um, Samsung services, auto blocker, customization services, personal data intelligence. Okay, check your region. Um, we'll go ahead and hit other state. Light or dark. Kind of a preference display mode, light or dark. Dark looks like that, light looks like this. We'll just go ahead and stick with the light, hit next. And it says, uh, you're all set up. Explore Galaxy AI features and more in settings. Um, so we'll be checking that out at some point. And we'll go ahead and hit new. And just like that, here is what the new um, device looks like. Nothing over there, we swing to the left. You're signed in, discovering on discover, swipe up. Just got a bunch of pre-downloaded apps notifications quick settings so there are if you swipe from the left versus the right um, pretty cool go ahead capture that so there you have it pretty pretty cool the Samsung Galaxy S25 Ultra massive camera on the back my sweaty palms from holding it but yeah power button volume up down Got nothing, the eSIM over here. We got the the Galaxy Pen. That's pretty cool. A little speaker down there at the bottom. And a little tray. So, pretty, pretty cool device. Uh, there you guys have it. My quick getting you to the home screen startup video. Hope you guys liked it. If you did, be sure to give it a thumbs up. And stick around for other tutorial videos. Peace.